we're going to be departing from Belleville Airport, runway 15. We'll be heading southwest bound towards the Lenawee County Adrian Airport. Yeah, 140, runway 5 left, quick for takeoff. We'll be doing a soft field takeoff off the grass here. Soft field technique involves pulling back right from the get go. Normally we would never be stopped on a soft field because we'd five left and, the and not be able to continue rolling. So imagine we're already rolling. We're going to add in full power, pull back, get the nose wheel up out of the mud, get the airplane into the, the ground effect as soon as possible. And once in ground effect and the main wheels leave the ground, we'll release the back pressure, allowing the airplane to lower its nose, fly close to the ground and ground effect, accelerate to a safe speed, preferably VX, this airplane 65 miles per hour, and then we'll climb out 65 and miss all our obstacles. We'll go ahead and call Willow Run Tower. Let them know we're going to be departing from within their airspace. Willow Run Tower, Skyhawk 153 Yankee, on the ground at Belleville, departing runway 15, southwest mound. 53 Inky, uh, on course approved, we'll run altimeter 3032. 3032, on course approved, 38 Yankee. All right, so we've got our flap set to 10. We've already talked to Willow Run Tower, so we're clear to go through his Delta airspace. We'll go ahead and add in full power, feet at the very bottom of the pedals, off the brakes. That's 45281. Pull back as hard as we can, get the nose up off the ground. Controlling direction with the rudder pedal, left and right. Directing for any sort of cross mode, which don't happen today with the airlines. Here's our stall horn, and we're in ground effect, lowering the nose, flying nice and close here. Accelerating, we have 65 miles per hour, and climbing out. Using lots of right rudder pressure there as the nose comes up and leaves the ground. Lots of feet factor trying to turn the airplane to the left. This is a full stop. We have good positive climb rate, good airspeed, good altitude. Go ahead and retract our flaps down to zero. That will be part of the flagship. And we'll climb out here, lower the nose for 80 miles per hour, and turn to our southwest mount heading. King Air 2 Golf Tango, runway 5 left. Typically, we look for at least 500 feet altitude before we uh, make any turns off runway heading. Due to uh, tower out there, off the departure end of runway 15 out of Belleville, we'll make our turn a little sooner just so we miss that tower.